This is Chat the Great. Expecting to fly. I mean, that knocked what the, um, what's the story Morning Glory by Oasis off the top spot. So that's that's pretty good. So the, how was that kind of getting to number one feeling? For one week, only for one week. Yeah, but you're still there, Mark. You're still right. there. <laughs> oh, that that was weird. I mean, that was that was it was all very surreal. Like I say, because we never set out to, or dreamed that we'd be the sort of band that was having number one records. And, yeah. Uh, and when it happened, it still felt peculiar. It felt like it was kind of happening to someone else, and we were getting sort of dragged along. Yeah, but I've seen like loads of like loads of articles, loads of magazines and stuff. Like they all they all like talk about this the punk like no no Oasis for one week. Were you like ever annoyed about that? Well, I, I suppose I, I suppose you know you ask anybody who's in a who's in a group. No, no one really likes to be compared to anybody else except by themselves. You know, it's like I know I tell you who we sound like. So um, uh, it all felt. Even though it was like a really sort of exciting time and the guitar music was very prominent and in the charts and in the press and on the radio, um, it still felt like um, it was quite limiting to just be compared to certain groups all the time. And, yeah. and, and I was never a particularly big fan of Oasis, so it didn't really flatter. Mm. I mean, but... I mean, and, and the bad thing about that is that people think they know they don't know what you sound like before they've heard you. Yeah. And yeah. they start to tell you what sort of band you are. It's like, no. <laughs> we're, uh, <laughs> we're our own people. <laughs> we do our own thing. We're and, a bit more gentle. We're a bit more gentle than that. Yeah. Leave us alone. <laughs> but that's it. You make music for you, don't you? You make music that you want. You're, you're crafting your sound. It's your journey. Like, people shouldn't... Yeah, and it's, I think as well at certain particular points, when, especially when you're starting out, Mm. You know, you're, you are wearing your influences quite more uh, prominently. Yeah. And um, it's, because, uh, it's because you're young. It's just because you're young. This is, this is all you've got so far. This is the worldview you have so far. This is the, yeah. These are the experiences you've had so far. So um, as you grow old and de- older and develop as a group or grow together, you know, you do start to find your own chemistry and your own sound and your own, mm. your own unique way of doing things.